Hey guys, in this video we're going to be showing you how to make some stinger hooks. We use these a lot on Detroit River, Saginaw River. Um, a lot of the time them walleye will end up biting the end of your jig and you don't have anything there to make an efficient hook set. So this is what we're going to be using for Detroit fishing, jigging. And you can also use this summertime for better hookups and uh, more efficient bites. We're going to be using the Eagle Claw size 8 hooks. You can basically find them anywhere. Uh, very cheap and reliable. In this video I'm going to be using the Floral Clear from P-Line 12 pound test. We'll usually use 8 to 12 pound test. Um, so right now we're going to start off with just your polymer knot, feeding it through, then back through, overhand knot, and then feeding that hook right back through itself and pulling it tight. This is about 90% of the time what I use to tie anything on. It's a very efficient, strong hook, or knot. So we'll get to the actual stinger knot now. Feed it through itself once, then a second time. Go ahead and cinch that loop right down. This will make it a nice short stinger. And then you're going to act like you're going to feed it through the third time, but you're just going to show that excess line showing between that loop and then you just pull with another hook and that cinches that knot right down. We'll go ahead and clip that excess off but you want to leave plenty of room there so you can pull either with your teeth or your hands that cinch knot out. So there's the end product. Very fast, easy, and cheap to do. And figured I'd like let you guys know. Thanks.